because that barbecue stuff, I hate it. Smoke gets in my eyes, it's just a mess. I, I just can't stand it. But other husbands barbecue for their wives. Well, I'm sorry. I'm not like other husbands, okay? But if you love me, honey, you'll buy a barbecue grill. Oh, honey. Hold it right there. You're under arrest. But what did I do? I didn't do anything. You have the right to remain silent. Anything you say can and will be used against you in the court of law. You have the right to a lawyer. If you do not have the money to afford a lawyer, one will be appointed to you. Do you understand these rights I've just told you? I guess so. Good. Exactly what are you accusing my wife of, officer? Multiple accounts of assault with a deadly weapon. Assault with a deadly weapon? When was I supposed to have committed this crime? According to our surveillance, the last attack was about a minute ago. One minute ago? That's totally impossible. She was right here with me a minute ago. Um, may I examine the victim? Yeah, go ahead. I, I'm the victim? I never did anything to him. That's what they all say. What about it, Doc? Oh, no. Oh, extensive heart damage. What, what, what's wrong? What's the matter? Lady, you're going away for a long, long time. Hold it there just a second. Nothing wrong with me. I'm in perfect health. Listen, Mr. Anderson, as a spouse of the suspect, you cannot be compelled to testify against your own wife. Do you give up your immunity? Absolutely. She's done nothing wrong. She's not guilty of anything. Denial is often associated with victims of assault. Mr. Anderson, didn't your wife just compare you with the other husbands just a moment ago? Let me quote. But other husbands barbecue for their wives. But what does that have to do Heartless with... woman. And did not your wife imply that if you didn't buy a barbecue for her, you didn't really love her? Oh, that. That's not assault! On the contrary, ma'am. My instrument showed serious heart damage here. I'm not guilty of assault with a deadly weapon. I can't help it if my husband's a tight wad. Oh, there she goes again, heartless woman. The human tongue does more damage than all the guns in the world combined. Extensive heart damage, they have no idea. Officer, you should know better than to interrogate my client before there is a legal counsel present. Anything she said up until this point cannot be used as evidence in court. You didn't admit to anything, did you? Well, I... Who called our lawyer? I suppose this officer told you that you were going to be spending an eternity in hell. I didn't say anything of the sort. You lawyers make me sick. It doesn't matter. My client is immune from prosecution. I had her dead to rights. You lawyers make me sick. Come on, Doc. They got us this time. No, I need to stay. The heart damage is severe. Hey, I feel fine. You may feel fine now, but heart damage from assault of the tongue has subtle symptoms. Like what? Like um, closing down emotionally or distancing yourself from your wife to avoid further attacks. Oh, honey, I had no idea. I'm so sorry. That's okay. What was that document you gave to that police officer? That was a copy of your wife's entry into the Book of Life. Book of Life? You mean because I'm a Christian? Yes. Jesus already paid the penalty for your crimes. Thank God. His forgiveness just gets us into heaven. But that doesn't repair the damage you've done in people's hearts. I'm so sorry, but I don't know what to do. Unfortunately, assault with a deadly tongue is an habitual crime. You'll need help to stop that bad habit. Also, you need to clear up things with other people you may have hurt. You're right. Come on, honey. Who did call that lawyer? <laughs>